podcast yes yes All right, and they're off. Give me one second here. Let me just get everything started up, guys, and then I'll start actually commentating. I'll give you guys the voice you guys deserve, the voice you guys need. All right, and looks like both runners are synced up and set to go. Good job, Restream. Thank you. Alrighty, folks, we're off to a beautiful day in the races. Dansta versus MiWi. Uh, Dansta clearly with a two minute better PB, so this is definitely is favored towards Dansta if I had to guess so myself. But MiWi is definitely a hot contender. Don't give up them, um, them at any time of day or any second. Because anything can happen when it comes down to Super Mario Odyssey Race, and anything will happen. For instance, we've seen people mess up tricks multiple times, and it just throws everything off. And who knows what? Happen during every bit of a race. Looks like Dance is getting the early lead here. About one second. Taking that early lead and grasping it. Go. I'm definitely feeling. You know what? I'm going to call it now. I'm just going to do it. Miwi is going to get sub hour this race. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. I can feel the pent up energy from Miwi's, Miwi's screen. Just urging to go faster. Urging to go into the unknown. The area untraveled. I'm feeling it. Looks like Dansta got a nice left side and managed to get the fast topper. There's no in-game audio. Hmm. Well then, we should have the restreamer fix that, shouldn't we? Ah, there we go. That was a nice save by MiWi on left side. Sorry for the late one there. All right, now we'll get to see potentially Dansta go for a uh, Dino Skip Skip. Uh, the last race they did, they missed it a couple times and decided to opt out of it. This will be interesting to see how they go on. I believe they have about an 80% success rate with it. Remember, if you can check the stats, I could be wrong about that. That's going off the top of my head. It'll definitely be interesting to see what Dansta does here. Alright, both players grabbing... Well, Dansta grabbing the moon. Um, I think lots of lag. It looks like it's fine from the restreamer's end. Dancing going for DSTA. Looks like the setup is clean and they got it. This will be a huge time lead for them. Uh, looks like there were no frames dropped, and looks like the connection is good. Dance to manage and get the spin throw. For some reason, during this Madame Brutal fight, whenever I try to do it, I can never get the spin throw, and I don't know why. It, like, it drives me insane. Utterly insane.
Ta 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 ta. Looks like everything's going down. All right, sorry guys, I was just doing some other stuff. Looks like Danston manages to get the nut clip. I mean, the chest clip. Sorry, wrong thing. Which will set them very far ahead. They have a very distinct lead over Mi MiWi. If I had to say, it looks like it's probably be due to about, I'd say, I want to say 15 seconds or so. Huge good start for Dansta. MiWi not that far behind, though. We'll definitely see how they do. Oh, that's why there was no audio. I am so sorry about that. I forgot to turn it on. Really me. Anyway. Gansa has to make the very important choice to hit the B button here and not mess that up. I know sometimes during my runs I accidentally hit the A button and then messed up the whole run. Miwi is now going to that very important chance. If missing the B button press here could be very detrimental. Missing them about three seconds potentially. I don't believe there would be reversed. Be though. Dansa managed to get the bird. Miwi entering the town that Dansa just started to take over. Dansa now exiting the pipes. We'll see if they got the DSTA. Looks like they should. They did. And so with a slight bonk there, but not gonna lose much time. Danson now beginning the long approach to uh, bullet bill dram or er, sand dram. Ow. I'm just wording today, wording up. Going up. Very nice climb by Dansta. Miwi now making their way to the sand on the moon. Hoping to get it with that first little ground pound. They managed to do it. Dansta going for the dram. Sand dram. Like they get it. Alright, looks like Dansa got the single bill as well. Very good job. Keeping that 100% consistency with that trick. Miwi getting the trick as well. I believe... Oh no! My bad. I misspoke. Miwi just barely missing the moon. I'll set them far behind. Sl Miwi slowly making their way up the wall. Breaking the moon. They're going to have a lot of time to make up, though, now. Gansa showing no mercy without being relentless, getting reverse Jaxi. Maybe waiting for the bullet bill. Ooh, the bullet bill saying, no, you can't capture me. I'm going to hit you. We make, er, Gansa making their way across the forest. And by forest, I mean desert. To the lone cactus. Dancing now leaving that cactus to be alone by itself forever. Going to a pile with birds on it. Miwi going for the reverse Jaxi. Looks like the setup is good. Very nice job by Miwi. Very nice, very clean reverse Jaxi. 
Dents it with a night little vault. Let's see if they can get the single single cap throw. That's a nice little time save tech to do. It, it's always just entertaining because like even I think lower level runners that that's something like they can easily accomplish, and it feels so satisfying when it's correctly. Alright, Dance to managing to leave the dreaded Sand Kingdom. Finally looking for that water. Going to a place filled with water. Lake. I mean, especially after a good Sand Kingdom. You need to go quench your thirst. Dance to missing the single spin throw. Or me Miwi. Single We gonna probably exit with a respectable 10.53 or something along, uh, maybe 10.57. Still very respectable. I think depending on the setup here, see how things go. See how things go with the lake. So going for the setup. Nicely done by Dansta. Miwi now entering the fold. Also looking for that good drink of water. Bunch their thirst from spending such a long time in sand. Missing the volt. Not bad though. Getting the zipper. Watching Miwi approach. Legendary. Going for the same clip that Dance to got very quickly and succinctly. Miwi decides to opt out of going for late clip. Meanwhile, Dance to approaching the last moon of it. and makes their way out of lake after quenching their thirst and now you know they grab some extra water so where else would you go but a forest you know you have to make sure you water your trees and water your forests very helpful good for the environment that's what dance is being right now dance is being green exiting lake with about a 1053 i think if i remember correctly around that Uh, Miwi going with an interesting path there. I think they made the mistake going for that moon. A little weird there. They just wanted to say hi to their friend. Yeah, they, they just forgot they were doing late clip. They just want to say hi. Hi to their friend in the forest, you know, the behind the wall. Before they went to go destroy Jango uh, Rob- Robert? Rango. Rango. Mimi with that one moon advantage could come in clutch. Who knows how that will play in. But too bad you don't get to carry moves over into other kingdoms. That'd be cool though if you could. But Miwi just wanted to make sure that they said uh said hello to their friend they haven't seen in a while. Never want to leave Land Kingdom without saying something. A good old friend. 
I mean, Dan's still approaching Nut Clip. Nice tech with the up throw. This Nut Clip still looks good. Going through. Let's see if Dancy can do the out of bounds movement. Or the OOB movement, for those of you who like to use acronyms. Looks like we're getting a little bit of lag there. Alright, Dance is spamming that button. I mean, breaking the nut. And then deciding, well, breaking one walnut isn't enough. So I might as well go for two. Uh, MiWi accidentally hitting the rock. Trying to get the bunny. They managed to get the bunny. Decent recovery from MiWi. MiWi's still a little behind, but can still win this. They just have to believe in themselves. Stay calm. Ooh, that looked dangerous for Dansta there. Almost thought they were going to miss it and have to do the backup strats of CMFP. Oh, for sure. MiWi is not out of this race whatsoever. Because it doesn't matter what the stats may say. Every race is a different variable. And different events happen in every person's life. That could lead them to success or failure. Alright, MiWi beginning to approach the nut clip. The clip of the nuts. Dancing entering the tower. Miwi doing the oob movement as well. Ooh, managing to clip through. Spamming that A button to get up the wall. Dance does going, going, lands beautifully, going for the nut on the side. Then we'll get to meet, be, go to my favorite part of Wooded Kingdom, the flooded pipes. We can see how a true master does it. The long jump, the cap throw. Jumping up, backflip, side flip, cap throw, dive, long jump, beautiful. Miwi managing not to mess up there. Very good. Ooh. Getting hit by the poison. Commentator's curse. Miwi with a beautiful first cycle. I believe that's beautiful one cycle of flooded pipes. Or dance set with beautiful cycle. Miwi going for Flower Road Skip, but missing it. That will be detrimental to their run. As long as Miwi finish... No, Miwi. Don't give up, Miwi. Anything can happen. Dansta may play like a robot sometimes, but I assure you, they bleed. Just like anyone else. Anything can happen. It's anybody's run. I'm a little confused with Miwi's path. I've never seen this before. Huh. That's a very interesting way to get up there. I actually, that was actually really cool to see. It's an interesting dive down. Dancer with a very nice hat and managing to get the loud hint art, which will save them a couple seconds later in the run. Dancer showing Bowser the lessons they took from Mike Tyson, hitting him one two one two one two punch. 
sending Bowser out of the ring. Uh, the hint art saves time because during Metro, you don't have to uh, ground pound to get that moon to get the money. You get the hint art there, which saves you like a second or two. And you lose no time for getting it in cloud, so it just saves you time. Dance it with a nice dot. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Dance it with a nice meme tree movement. All right, Miwi approaching my favorite part of what it? The flooded pipes. A roll, a long jump, two cap throws, dive, you spin pound. Interesting. I like their tech. Ooh, it looks like me we managed to mm, looks like me we missed the cycle that's okay maybe we'll still get out of wooded at around 20 in, in the 20 range definitely a 20 probably x40 maybe x50 or 50x oh looks like dance is going for i believe that is recalled a reverse Oh my goodness, I'm so Get the shoot out in front of you, Danny. All right. Danny getting the reverse trap pedal. Very nice, keeping their 100% average. Miwi now is on the hunt for blood, finding Bowser along the way as they exit Wooded with a 2104. Wow, well, my timing was terrible. That was a very solid, very solid loss by Dansta. All right, Dansa now entering the Metro, the fight with the Wiggler, while Miwi is here saying, Hey, Bowser, I'm having a not the best time right now, so I'm going to get you. I'm going to destroy you. Getting a little bit of the rig out. They also managed to get the hint art. First try, very nice, saving them time later in the run. Ooh, they missed the fast hat, though. I'll end up losing them time. That time that they would have saved, now that was a lot. Miwi also, Bowser grabs the hat before Miwi can grab it back. Very rough. Dance him missing the first jump up using onto the me Metro. Grabbing the moon though, not bad. They're staying calm, cool, collected. You can see it on their face. They know they're in the lead. They know they just need to do safe strats. Miwi missing the second fast hat on the cloud. This is a rough cloud for Miwi for sure. Ooh, Dansa getting a nice, very nice uh, tower. That looks pretty to watch. Like we're getting some lag on dance to There we go. Fixing itself. Alright, Miwi has now entered the land of the lost. The Jurassic World. Oh no. Miwi misses meme tree. That's going to be a rough one. This looks like it should make it. Managed to get the meme tree on the second try, making their way up through Lost. Dansa now lining up their shots to take out the Wiggler, the Mecha Wiggler. Four. Five. Six, seven shots. Bing, bang, boom, pop. It's dead. 
Ooh, Mimi with a nice little spin throw there. That looks pretty. Ooh, getting the moon up there. I know when I used to run. Like, at the very beginning of my runs, I would miss that jump up to that moon. Be detrimental to my runs. It always leave me with a sour taste in my mouth. And Dance is about to leave the metros of the night. Miwi deciding to tank a hit to destroy the moon. A very noble sacrifice. Dancy getting scooter clip on the first try. Keeping. I believe they have not messed up scooter clip at all. Double checking here. Scooter clip. Oh, nope, they missed it once. Keeping it at an 80%. Dance is also approaching my girlfriend's favorite moon right here, talking to a man on a bench. Basically, being their friend. Whatever they may be. Miwi now entering Metro, saying, Hey Dansta, I hear you like the city. Don't mind if I meet you here. Dansta going to attempt to gamble. Dansta's gamble is, of course, 100% of the time right. Dancing now entering the very cool and very maneuverable Bullet Bill Room. This is always a room I love to watch, just because I think the movement is so cool. Especially when you get the single bill here. Gambling in video games. What's that? There- Oh! There we go! Beautiful job by Danston. Miwi making their way through the tower, trying to catch up to Dansa. Dansa taking out the trash and now leaving the rest of the trash can, taking it with them, and they're planning to leave the city with it. The trash being that specific moon. Back jump, back jump. Dancer climbing the pillar like King Kong, saying this is my city, and I will show you who the ruler is. Now diving down and deciding to take a nice swim at the bath, at the pool. Not going for the hint art there because they got the cloud hint art, saving them a little bit of time. Will Dancer go for reverse room? We already saw it once today. Who knows? Looks like a no reverse. Would have been cool to see. Twice in one round? Sanity. Miwi now approaching the Mecha Wiggler. Landing their shots on their fiery... The fire. Missing the first bubble. Miwi staying cool and collected. Hitting it. Come on, Miwi, you got this. One more. One more. Oh, just barely missing it. Miwi now having to opt to for a three cycle. Definitely going to be a rough one. Dansa now leaving Metro. Saying bye, Miwi. I'll see you. Canada. Miwi landing the shot for the third cycle. Yeah. 
Looks like we're getting some lag on me. It's my end. I, I'm not dropping any frames or anything, and my connection seems good. Okay, Jensen now saying hi to Toad. Hey, Toad. You have anything for me? And Toad's like, yeah, I got a moon for you, bud. Here, take it. And Mario being grateful and taking it. Looks like Miwi is just entering Day Metro. Their first cool trick will be Metro Dram. I believe that is what they call it. Is a Dram Strat. Grabbing the moon. Doing the Dram. Let's go, Miwi. Now let's do the scooter clip. I believe in you. Let's go. Lining up. Yes! Very nice. Clean, good movement from Miwi there. That's the kind of thing you want to see. Now Miwi hitting a trash. Go. Dansa trying to land up the clip. Dansa shaking their head no, this isn't going to land. They know it. Oh, by the way, Miwi is at um, my girlfriend's favorite moon right now. This one. The guy on the bench. Yeah. Because Mario's being a friend. This guy who's lonely. And, you know... In a big city, it's easy to be lonely because there's lots of people and no one will talk to you. Mario being the best one. Mario being a true gentleman. Dance is saving that one spiny. Will this spiny have superpowers? No. Dancing manages to get it and save the little time with the camera angle. Me, we deciding to gamble. Knowing that if they'll need to gamble if they want to catch up, they get the gamble on the first attempt. Very good job. Miwi taking the risk and landing it as well. Alright. Jensen now going to the Goomba Room. We'll probably get to see some nice little vectoring here. Nice little vectors from the Goombas, making them go fast. Supersonic speeds, some would say, but then some people would say that's the wrong game and yell at me. I'll let you decide. Bonking, but getting the moon. Still a good result. Miwi going for the bullet room. Cap throw dive. Very nice by Miwi. Nice recovery strat, even though they missed it the first time. I like Peaceful Storm just wants to flex that he has a girlfriend. Every no, no. I just do it because then I tell her about it and it makes her squirm every time. If she wasn't sleeping, she'd be yelling at me by now. Dansta getting the nice whoomp from the tube. Alright, Dansta now approaching Snowdram. The thing that can ruin runs and just make everything detrimental. Let's look at the stats sheet here, guys. Let's, let's approach the stat sheet. What's Dance's success rate on it? We're grabbing, going down the sheet. Moondram. Snowdram. A 57.1%. Let's see if they can improve it. This looks good. Oh. Unlucky. You can see the anger in Dance's eyes. Shaking their head. Still have a large lead. It's okay. Oh, were you? Oh, that's so rough. No way! Oh, that's so rough. That's a rough one. Okay, Dance Dut. What are you going to do? You're going to succeed. You're going to try, try again. Every kid wanted to be a Tony Hawk guy when they were growing up. And how did Tony Hawk succeed? He tried and tried. How many times did he fall down? He fell down a lot. But guess what? He didn't give up. And now look at him. He has like five video games about him, and if you have his signature, it's worth like a million dollars. Dansa being a true Tony Hawk right there. Alright, this is definitely time for Miwi to catch up. Uh, also guys, just so you know, the timer for on Dansa's end is slightly off, just for the signature. Uh, Dansa's current time right now is actually... They're three seconds behind the timer. Just so you guys know. Miwi, don't say that. No run is dead. 
No run is dead unless you say it's dead. Every run can be completed as long as you complete it. The only way a run dies is if you give up. That is the only way a run is dead. Everything else right now is just improvement. Right now, you're just going for a gold. Hey, I might not PB this run, but you know what I can do? I can get a gold in snow. And that's what I'm going to try to do. Everything is just an IL now. That's how I think about it. Every bad run, just got to keep going. Keep moving forward. Because that's how winning is done. You might be inconsistent right now. But think about it. You're also, you might be inconsistent, but you're also getting your bad movement out. Ooh, Dansta getting a little bit of a bonk while trying to climb up and getting this moon. Nice little up throw tech. Very nice. Okay, Dansta going through. Did Dansta switch to the Joy-Cons? Will we see a down throw? No, we'll see in. We'll see a casual dive. going up. Miwi, now approaching a moon. Uh, does Miwi go for the clip here? That will be the next thing on the stats sheet that I believe we will see from Miwi. Uh, my stat sheet is bugged. Oh, well. We'll find out. They go for it. Um, I believe Dansta does do Spiritless. Yes. Will Dansta go for it now? I believe... The correct play would to not do Spiritless in this room. Just from a run perspective, I believe Danta should just stay to safe strats, not do anything too spicy. They have a huge lead, they shouldn't do it. But let we all know, Danta doesn't care about the odds winning. Danta basically races against himself every run. So Danta will probably go for it. Danta wants to put Salt in the wound, and what better kingdom to do that than Luncheon, where Salt is everywhere. Not actually wanting to put salt in the wound. That was just that was just clever banter. I just thought of that on the spot, and that's like, ooh, that sounds cool. All right, Miwi making it to the Goomba room. We might get to see some cool vectoring by the Goombas here. Taking a little bit of damage, we'll slow them down slightly. True. Climbing on, getting the Goomba, getting the Goomba. The vectoring by the Goombas just looks so cool every time I see it. It's like, zoom, 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 zoom. It's like, what? All right, Dansta now leaving Seaside. Miwi getting a nice line. Very nice line by Miwi. To collect this moon. Will Miwi get the zoomp into the pipe? Let's find out. All right. Cutscenes for both players. Okay, okay. Got the jump into the pipe. That's always so satisfying. One of my favorite part about any run. That's like my favorite part of snow is just getting the jump. It just makes a cool sound and it's so sad. All right. Hi, 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 Troy. Or ooh, no, Dance is taking a little bit of damage there. Oof. Okay, Dance. Got this. There we go. All right, Miwi approaching the Snowdram. This is potential time save for Miwi. To catch up onto the Dansta. Perfect first attempt. Good job, Miwi. Catching up, saving a little bit of time. Those are the things they're going to need. Uh, um. Yep, Dansta deciding to go Mario Go Zoom. Miwi, very nice job by Miwi. That was very beautiful. Very beautiful snow dram. That is a time save for Miwi. That's something Miwi can be proud of for this run. Definitely. Dansta climbing up the wall. Going, rolling around at the speed of sound. You got places to go now. They gotta follow their rainbow. Alright, Dansta deciding to take the gamble again. Will Dansta make the gamble? 
Jansen makes the gamble. Okay. Jansen with- Oh, nice little up throw by Miwi there. I think if Miwi hadn't of up thrown there for that split second, they wouldn't have gotten enough height to make that jump. Very nice little- Very good acknowledgement from Miwi knowing what to do. Uh, no. Miwi does not use Joy-Cons, to my knowledge. I believe- I believe there was one- I think there's one player that does. I don't know. I think they use Joy-Cons this run. But I don't think they do Miwi bonking. Um... Miwi bonking twice. Hey there uses Joy-Cons, yes. Hey there. Yes. Hey there uses Joy-Cons. Oh, up throws don't increase height. Oh, my bad. Sorry. Misinformation there. Alright. Dance okay, this is one of my favorite movement pieces on Dance's screen right now. This is one of my favorite movements. And then you get to just bounce. Oh, wow. Dance didn't even go bounce on the cappy. That was still beautiful, though. They make such a large distance with that. It's so cool to watch. I just love it every time. Alright, MiWi now making their way through the tunnel full of coins. Making sure to collect every coin. Except those ones that they didn't collect. Because those coins are... Because greed can lead to bad things. And MiWi knows not to be greedy this run. What's MCCT? I could not tell you. I apologize. Maybe someone more knowledgeable in that can. Right? Jensen now buying a moon. Miwi approaching the fish clip. Going down. Very nice fish clip by Miwi. Let's see how they do on the dive. This is always dangerous. Very not even close to clipping in bounds. Miwi wants to make a comeback. Miwi can make a comeback, and Miwi is going for a comeback. Miwi will not give up. There's still a major spot where Gansta could mess up, and that'd be right here. If they miss getting the invisible block, no invisible block miss. That was one of the biggest spots for Mimi to potentially catch up on time. Very nice movement from Dansta. Dansta now making the room to one of my favorite sub areas. Doing this sub area fast just feels so satisfying. I think I've gotten it once and I've tried like 50 times, but it's just so satisfying and it's so cool to see. This little jump up here and then you get to do a motion control throw that like jump down here again, 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 jump up to do, do. So cool. It's so fun to do and it's so satisfying when you do it correctly. Alright, Dancis gonna say hi to Miwi as they cross paths in luncheon, saying, Oh, you're just getting here? I guess I'm gonna leave. Ooh, Miwi! Ooh, nice job by Miwi. Making up little bits of time where Dansa spent time. Losing it. Very good move from Miwi. It's these little things that Miwi has to do to keep getting more points. Nice, Miwi. Alright, Dancing now gonna enter Ruined. Um, we'll do... Uh... Hmm. Do you guys want the uh, shoutouts now, or do you guys want them after... We'll do them now. All right, as Miwi is approaching defeat on the Spirit, we're gonna take some time to talk about Plan B Sports. Plan B Sports is an organization that is sponsoring this with 250 euros, and I believe people can also add on to that, and I believe we've added a total of 180 euros towards the prize pool. Very thank you, Pri Plan B Sports, for sponsoring this event, and thank you for doing the event. And thank you everyone who's contributed towards the prize goal. Uh, shout out to the restreamer, PeacefulStorm13. 
Thank you for doing this. We know you had a little trouble there, but that's a okay. Shoutouts to the runners, Dansta and Miwi. Thank you both for doing this run and playing it. It makes it fun to watch, and we just love to watch you guys. So thank you for giving us this tournament. Uh, we'd also like to thank everyone doing stats. I believe the two people doing stats for this run are uh, Ren Lei and Gamer Pro 887 Thank them both. And I would also like to thank you, chat, for coming by and watching. It wouldn't be a true spectacle without you, without everyone here. I believe it's spelled with an S, and I don't know if it got updated. I'll update it here in a second. Um, and also, thank you. Is that everything? Dun 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 dun. Plan B Sports. Do 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 do. Oh, and thank you for our announcer. Thank you for our announcer, Peaceful Storm Thirteen. Uh, thank you for saying things. We know you're spinging up your words sometimes, but that doesn't matter. We appreciate you for commentating. And now back to our regularly scheduled, regularly, regularly scheduled programming: the race between Dance and Miwi. Uh, Dansa is still <laughs> uh, Dansa still making their way through the Ruined Dragon. Uh, Miwi now approaching the Fork Room. Doing a nice little up throw. Oh, spinning around. A nice little up throw again. Showing that you don't need Joy Cons to do up throws. We're trying really hard. Thank you. I think that's a compliment. I don't know if it is. Oh, Miwi going for the cool little tech here. This feels so satisfying to get when you get it accomplished. Boom, 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 boom. There was uh, one runner who told me to stop going for the center there. Uh, it was uh, Tachi something. Uh, Tachi XXV. We haven't heard from them in a while, but I guess at high levels you can go for it. IXVI, that's what it was. Yes, yeah, so they used to tell me to stop going because I'm... For me personally, I'm not a high level runner like such as these runners, but it's it's easier to mess up for beginners if you go for the middle platform. So they typically go to the right. Just something I don't know what everyone's typical run is, run speed is nowadays, but just good little information. Save you a little time potentially. Alright, Dancing now entering the Bowser realm. The realm of the Bowsers. Similar to the Shadow Realm from Yu-Gi-Oh, but not the same. For instance, um, Shadow Realm was made up. Bowser's world is really real. Alright. Against him messing up the fast strat, but that's not going to be a problem. They get the recovery. Against him saying hi to the block man. Oh, wait. Oh, did you leave your head wide open? Oh, I guess I'll just hit it. Dansa throwing an up throw in the air, just like they do not care. Alright, Miwi now um, leaving luncheon. It will be approaching it now. They're getting the Story Moon. They will be leaving very shortly, and they will go in to fight the dragon. Because they are the chosen one. The chosen one to slay the dragon. Dancer with another up throw. Alright. Dancer with the shards. Let's see it move. One. Gets it. I know Dancer was having trouble with that in last week. Nice up throw tech. Nice shards, Dancer. Very well. That was much better than last week. Good job. If I'm remembering it correctly. That was very- that was much cleaner. Good job, Dansta. Alright, now Dansta going for what I believe Mitch SMO wants to call Pokey Main Dram. But what most people in the Super Mario community call uh, Bowser Dram. I believe they were on here that said that one. Dram. 
Oh no wait, they said they didn't want it named Pokegem because Pokemane is a god. Never mind. Yes. That was a miscorrection by me. Against it getting the Bowser Dram. Nice. That's a very, very 77 salute. Er, sorry, I think I mispronounced your name. But that's very impressive. Alright, Dansta deciding to get Harriet first because they want Topper to live longer. Because they like Topper better. Remember, everyone in chat, if you go for Harriet first, you like Topper. If you go for Topper first, you like Harriet. That's how it works. So, just another run, I was, like, just in one of my runs, like, this week, I was trying to do the fast thing there with Harriet, like, throw the cap early, and I kept missing up the angle. And I was so salty about it. And I had no idea why I was missing. Alright, very nice move. Very nice moves from Dansta. Getting a little bit of lag here. That's okay, still doing a very fast topper. Hitting the hat. Saying, oh wait, I know where you are. Your magical hats don't hide you from me. I have the all-seeing eye. Miwi, fight- Ooh! Miwi, avoiding all the spinning spheres. Er, by spheres, I mean cylinders. And by cylinders, I mean... Circles? Circles of lightning. Discs. Discs. Discs, they're rings, like Sonic. Discs, rings, same thing. Kind of. The discs are solid, rings are not. Miwi, will Miwi get the triple jump? Miwi, I believe, got a double jump, but still very good, very good ruined, if I do say so myself. Dancin now approaching the mech. Well, not yet. They have to make this one trick real quick. Will they make it with ease? They make it with ease, not a problem in the air. An up throw. Oh, Dance is doing this without fixing the camera angle it just amazes me every time. <laughs> because I know if I tried it, I would get confused which way I'm facing, and I would put it the wrong way, and I would just dive right off the edge. That's a very nice movement from Dance to there. Making the way up the Poke Wall. Wait, Me Wee leaving Ruined. Going into the Bowsers. Alright, Dansta. This is where the run will most likely get made or braid. Made or paid. Made or fade. If Dansta dies to mech here, that will be a huge hope for Miri. Doesn't look like Dansta's going to, though. Dansta with the nice, I believe... Actually, I'm not going to even attempt to. Oh, this is a very nice mech first cycle thing. First cycle attempt. All right, good job. Good job from Dansta. Miwi, I believe, made the jump that... There. Dansta spinning. Harriet's down. Let's see if Dansta can kill the Spewart. Throw. Dive. Death. The Mecha Brutal is down. Miwi, now entering the place of the shards. Oh, yeah, no. Miwi, yeah. Maybe I would say up until um after Metro, uh, Miwi's been very consistent, 100%. Nice little spin throw. Spin throw save times. So They're a faster capture. Good thing to know for every runner. Oh, trying to get the single dive. Oh, trying again. The coin just avoiding them. Barely. The shard saying, no. I don't want to be collected. Miwi not giving it a chance, though, and collecting all the others. Dansta now leaving the Bowsers. Miwi making their way towards the bunnies after this moon collection.
Gets a left with like a 54-36. That was a very good job, I believe. I know lots of people would... Ooh, nice Bowser Jam by Miwi. Lots of people would be very satisfied with the time that either of these runners get. Miwi going for Harriet. Dansa deciding to channel their inner Miles Pro. Very nice movement. Going to the moon. Rolling, 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 rolling. Jumping. Very nice. Getting the dual flowers. Uh, can we see a sub hour? I believe so. Dansta going for the single. Nice, Dansta. Very nice, Moonskip. I believe sub hour is possible by Dansta. Uh, just off the top of my head. Miwi showing that they also have the power of Dansta, saying Topper, I can see where you're hiding, you can't. Dansta making the way up to the Bowser. Showing Bowser, they gave Bowser a little taste of their training with Mike Tyson before, but now Dansta showing them the true taste of Mike Tyson. Maybe even a little bit of Ian McGregor, if you guys know who that is. Taking training lessons from the best fighters, martial artists of everyone. No, this is not the last race. I believe we have three more. Or two more, sorry, misspoke. Two more after this one. Dance to jumping. Dance to jumping. Doing a knockout punch. Bowser's still in it. Let's give the prop to Bowser for making being able to withstand that many punches. But Mario's saying, nope. That's not gonna matter. Yes. To my knowledge, Miwi... Yes. Miwi got Bowser Jam. Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. <sighs> Jumping. Jumping. Jump it. Louder! Oh, is, will this be the knockout punch for the Bowser? It will be. Bowser is now KO'd. Miwi now making their way to the mech. Let's see how good of a mech Miwi can get. Anyone, mech is just an amazing thing to see. I love seeing birdless mech. I just think the movement's fun. I just think it's just fun in general. Let's watch Miwi here. Very nice. Nicely done by Miwi. Getting up onto the topper. All right, Rango. Rang Rango. Very quickly. Hitting the topper. Nice job by Miwi. Not going for topper acquired if I am correct. All right, that was a very clean mech. So far, this is a very clean mech by Miwi. Uh, Dansa now approaching a potential, the uh, potential. This is probably the last big mess up potential, which would be missing 2D skip. They do not miss 2D skip. Very nice mech by Miwi. That was very clean. All right, Bowser Mario is now making their way out of Moon. They're trying to blow this pop ba 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 popsicle stand. Trying to blow this popsicle stand out of the water. A fast pillars is always a good pillars, so let's watch them break down the pillars. All right, Dansa going for that one. Kudos for commentating, not only. The Thank you. Can this be sub hour? I believe it can be, and I believe it will be. Dansa, Miwi, 
is going to make it to the moon, but will Miwi make it to the moon before it explodes on Dance to Screen? Let's see. Miwi getting sent off. And Miwi is blasting off again! And by Miwi, I meant Dance to... Very solid run by Dansta. Um, my timer was off for Dansta, by the way. Dansta is, was, this timer's three seconds ahead of Dansta. Yeah, this timer's three seconds ahead of Dansta. Just, you know, it's synced with MiWi, but not Dansta. So that was a 59.45. Still a very solid run. All right. Dance to Miwi is still in this race. Now, what's very important for here is for Miwi just not to DC. Because as long as Miwi finishes the race, they do get points. So now, the goal here is just for them to complete the run so they get some points. That's all they need to do. Very nice vectoring from Miwi. Oh yeah, we can switch the music. Very nice dance though. Climbing the wall. Wait, really? Is that how it went? I'll have to relook at the rules. I thought they got points as long as they finish. I'll have to relook at the rules. But anyway, we can do that after. Now we watch Miwi make their epic escape from Moon. Saying Hey, Bowser, that's my lady, and you can't have her. Going down. Nice spin throw. Going up. Oh, wow. Miwi's taking lessons from Jackie Chan? Oh, wow. The punches were fast, and they were true. Very nice job by Miwi. Miwi showing that you can do more than just punch, you can also kick too. Lining up the shots. Uh, 59.43 is dancing time. Um, or 59.45, sorry. 59.45. Uh, Alright, Miwi has to do spin pounds here, because everyone knows spin pounds save time. So for every spin pound, Miwi does spin. This saves the time. Time is saved. Because that's how that works, right? The spin pound saves time. Alright. The jump. The jump. The jump. Bopping him. Uh, I have no idea much how ICC saves. Maybe now making it their way to the Bowser escape. Taking Bowser's body. Jumping around. Uh, ice cave skip, or ice clip, but ice, ice baby. That's what ICC stands for. All right, let's go, Miwi. Miwi clawing their way to escape. Miwi wanting the points. Miwi going for it. Yes, let's go, Miwi. Oh. Uh, that was hype. You saw, they made the first jump. That was dope. Going, going. Breaking through the rocks. Trying to escape. Falling through. Not letting anything stand in their path. Oh, 
that's upsetting. Still me, we remember. This is just good practice. with a bunch of hits on the pillar. Oh, just one short. Nicely done. Very nice movement by Mimi. Okay. Mimi going for the... Going for the wire. Alright. Maybe approaching the wire. As long as Mimi's controller doesn't die, it looks like they will get a 10520. Very respectable time by Miwi. I know lots of people would want that time. Good run by both players. Looks like Danza is our winner. Uh, let's see if either of them want to do uh a thing where they talk to us and tell us their feelings about the run. Hello. What's up? Oh, you guys can't hear me. I can't hear you peaceful. Yes, yeah, sorry. I realize. Yo. Sorry, I realize. You... No, no. <laughs> so the runs, uh, dancer first. Ten things or er, five things you did well. Um, not snow drum. That, that, um, that's not something you did. Oh, what's something you did well? Yeah, you didn't give yeah, up on snow jam. You kept doing, doing snow jam. I did not doing snow jam well. You should. Because I met the snow. Okay. <laughs> DSS, wow. wooded, uh, leg clip, mm, lost, mech. Was oh, that five? Knew. I think that was four. Can... What um, were some things you were proud of? Like, what was just. What were your thoughts on the run? I mean, like the early game was really good. Twenty-eight fifty-four metro exit. That's easily fifty-eight pace. And then I just messed up Snowdrum twice, lost forty seconds, and then lunch in twenty seconds. So like that's just a minute right there. And the rest wasn't perfect. Like night metro wasn't perfect, uh, and moon wasn't perfect. Like, there were mistakes, but in general, other than Snowdram and Lunchin, it was a pretty good run. For sure. Yeah. What my about run you? was... My run was pretty much BTT level, aside from uh, a lot of time loss. So, if you just pretend I played... Uh, that I didn't lose any time to BTT, just removing the time I lost to BTT, I played like BTT. That's... You exactly just remove the time loss to BTT. Uh, also, I golded, I'm I golded first... Mac. <laughs> I'm literally first because of the 90 points. <laughs> yeah. I... Mm -hmm. I... Okay. I am bad. <laughs> no, you're not. Okay. Wait. Well, let's I'm not talk bad. I'm not bad. I'm just rusty. I'm just rusty. Yeah, you're rusty. And I'll, Thank like, you, Mimi. Thank you. Yeah, like, before, the, like, I would say Metro. Metro, everything before Metro was kind of eh. But, um... No, more than that. <laughs> yeah. But after Metro, though, you were really showing... Like, it, you, it was coming back. You Like, the muscle memory was there. It was like, oh, I can do this. I can do this. Oh, mech? What's mech? That's easy. And you were doing some things faster than Danced was doing. So it was like, oh, that's some time save. There's less checkpoints. No, there's less, less choke, choke points, personally. <laughs> no, nah. Uh, I, yeah, I, I agree. That's been a trend just in my races. The early game has been the worst part. Uh, I I need to do more runs because when I do more runs, I play the early game more and I get better early game, obviously. But uh, <laughs> need to do runs. I'm gonna. I'm. I think I should be able to like start uh playing again soon because it's mostly been getting caught up on homework. Uh, I'm. I just want to get be caught up on school just to. Just before I really try an SMO again. Oh, for sure. School uh, comes first. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, though I, I could be doing school faster. Like I, I, I'm really procrastinating on that. But to uh, speed run school. Yeah. Uh, I actually, yeah, I actually like did all of my history assignments with a live split timer, so I wouldn't get off track. <laughs> I put like estimate splits in there. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, it sounds fun. Yeah, yeah. 
Uh, I'm caught up in that one, in that class. Uh, no, uh, yeah, no, it's 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 just rest. Uh, it's just rest. I don't know what else to say. Uh, it's a, I'll, I golded mech though. That's by a second. I need to get fifty eight sub. If I if I I haven't been playing like seriously in almost three months. If I have, if I was playing seriously in those three months, I'd probably have like fifty eight three x sob or something. That's my estimate. Uh, like, or maybe four x. <laughs> but it's at fifty nine oh one still because I don't play. Uh, though the the race was fun, even though I was playing kind of bad, it was fun. Either of you guys have any final words? Uh, GGs. GGs first sub, my, my first sub hour in the league. Happy about it. It's pretty pog. Twenty oh. eighth in total. Pog. And you're first now, right? Yeah, but that was like I didn't even know that it was possible, even if I got full points. Yeah, I didn't know but either. Apparently, I, yeah, I thought the best you could get was third. <laughs> no, I mean, I, 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 I heard that I can be second, but apparently I can be first. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. But I'm not gonna stay up here because, like, now the, I don't want to say it's, uh, but the like easier matches are done for me because I started like uh, sixth seed and I started with seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Now it's going one, two, three, four, five, and then twelve. So now I'm playing Mitch and Tarn and Lucid, and I don't think I'm gonna stay first to be honest. <laughs> It'll be close. Yeah. <laughs> Right, Mimi, do you have any parting words? Uh, hi, boy. <laughs> <laughs> boy. All right, sounds good. Uh, I think we're going to get set up for the next race then. Thank you both for doing it. Make sure you visit both their channels, Dansta uh, on Twitch, and Miwi also. Both did a very good job.